So before we start this video out today, this is the moment I'm starting to package and ship all of the merch that I've got in. This is the moment I'm finally putting together all the shipping supplies and everything so I can ship out the merch to you guys. I've got about 10 shirts that are going out today. I'm gonna to show you guys a little bit of that process before we jump into the video. I hope you guys enjoy. This is something that I would really love to share with you guys even though it not, might not be the most exciting thing in the world. It's a huge step in the process. Again, if you guys wanna buy a shirt, let's get this bread shirts. If you guys want one, DM me, thatwide.bowtie on Instagram, and I will make sure to get one to you guys. Got all of the stuff packaged up, everything together, hashtag bread gang on them. And I'm running into the post office right now. Huge moment on the channel, I'm so excited. We're gonna see how this goes. Hopefully it's not crazy expensive, but just big moment I wanna share with you guys. So excited, hashtag bread gang. Man, such an awesome feeling. It is all in the hands of the US Postal Service now. Let me know when you guys get them. I'm so excited to see you guys rock the shirts, but let's jump into this awesome video. What is up, Bread Gang? Today is a very special day. One, because there is a new mod on the channel, if you guys can tell by the thumbnail. But two, every day is a great day when you're wearing a uh, official Bread Gang merch shirt. I mean, you, you just can't get any better than that. I know I talk about them all the time, but that's just because I'm so excited to finally have merch and be able to wear and represent my own stuff. That's such an amazing feeling. Me and the beautiful girlfriend, which is walking up right behind me, hello, are going to get something to eat tonight. <laughs> She's not wearing her shirt tonight. We could have been matching, but maybe next time. We're heading out, we're gonna get something to eat. Tonight is gonna be a little bit of a, a two minute restaurant review slash mod reveal. So I hope you guys are excited. Stick around, stick. I hope you guys are excited. Stick around for the ride. It's gonna be a great night. Let's get started. My window is <laughs> sorry. My my window is really dirty, but if you guys can tell, we're going to cook out tonight. Not the most pristine place, but it's something that Did you say your window is dirty? Yeah, the outside of my window is dirty. That's anyway, the inside. No, the out it's the outside. There's like mud and, and stuff inside. thrown. The inside's dirty too. Anyway, anyway. We're going yeah, my truck is really dirty right now. Two things. One, we're eating cookout tonight, so stay tuned for that. That's what we're gonna run in here and do before I start this video, because I'm freaking hungry. If any of you are from the north, or mid-north, or Georgia, or an up. Northwest. Northwest, whatever. Not northwest, no. If you're from Georgia and up, you know what cookout is. We don't have cookout in Florida. Georgia. But we're gonna run in here and get some cookout. It's really cheap, and you get a lot of stuff really cheap, so I'm really excited. So we're gonna go do that, and then I will show you guys the new mod that I've finally got installed on the truck. That definitely wasn't bad. Some guy just honked at me. 11 bucks for two chicken sandwiches, two quesadillas, two fries, and two drinks. Not bad. It, it wasn't bad. I mean, it wasn't like, tell your mom, but it wasn't bad. I mean, I ain't mad at it. It, the tea, tea was the best part. 7.8 on the tea. Like the tea. I gotta give the tea a solid rating. The tea was not bad. You want mine? The tea's not bad, I'm telling you. So, we're gonna run through the drive. I say that it wasn't that bad. We're about to run through the drive through and get something else. So, <laughs> so <laughs> I, I swear we're getting to this new mod to the. Another one! We're getting to the new mod eventually, I promise. That's good. Hello? You want a milkshake? No. Hi, welcome to cookout. Hey, how's it going? What can I get for you? Can I just get one chicken quesadilla 
and uh, one bacon wrap. What comes on the bacon wrap? Anyway, let me give you guys a little backstory about these lights. These are the lights that I, when the truck got the differential all messed up, these are the lights that got put in with the new headlight housings, and I could never get them to work. I told you guys that they were supposed to change colors and all this stuff, and they're from Lighting Trends. Huge shout out to Lighting Trends. They're great quality. And I'll show you guys. Thank you. Huge shout out to Lighting Trends and my beautiful girlfriend for getting me these lights. She actually bought those. Um, I am not daddy's money, I'm girlfriend's money. The great sugar mom, that's my sugar mom right there. <laughs> A few moments later. Obviously you guys can tell it's the next day. There was no possible way I was going to get anything done last night. Me and her were just absolutely being ridiculous start from the beginning with this mod so when I was rebuilding the truck or getting the truck redone with all the front differential parts we did the upper control arms and uh, some other stuff as well the new headlights I wanted she had gotten me some bulbs to put into the truck that were the lighting trends demon eyes the demon eyes did not fit with the other aftermarket headlights which is why we switched over to these that are on there currently so the special thing about these one Huge shout out to Lighting Trends. They are great quality. We'll start from the beginning, like I said. I couldn't get them in the other housing, so we had to switch over to the new housings, and that's where we ran into our issue. The long story short, I couldn't figure out how to get them to work. I got everything installed, which I'm gonna show you right now. These are color changing. So you have your, obviously your white LED, but it has multicolor with it as well. So it's pretty much demonized, but it's any color. So red, orange, green, anything you can think of everything's good to go we're just trying to get it back in and you know kind of mock it up and see where it's going to go and i ran into a couple issues with the install which is i'm going to show you right now as well so if you're doing any kind of aftermarket lights this piece has to go through here so we had to drill a hole through the back of this and we're going to fill that with something just to be able to get through through that hole obviously so anybody that's doing aftermarket lights and you end up watching this video huge huge tip make sure drill a hole and be able to fill this with something so you can get your aftermarket wiring through but after we finally got everything installed i for months and months i could never figure out i had called lighting trends a couple times talked back and forth and i just couldn't figure out how to get them to work long story short it ended up being there was a connection bad somewhere huge shout out to josh his uh his actually youtube channel he just started a youtube channel will be in the link in the description below go give him a subscribe help him out josh got the lights working and now i can finally show him to you guys they are bluetooth and the bluetooth app is phenomenal i want to show you guys how easy this app is to use i mean you got your on and off button here for the lights you have your connection to your device which would be your lights obviously my bluetooth is not on right now so it's not going to show up i mean you got all your different settings you got your color wheel then you've got your preset color wheel all your presets at the bottom you can sync your music up to it from your from your apple music and you can play whatever song you have on your, on your apple music through it you can set it up to go off of your voice so every time you talk, just like right now, the lights would flash and stuff as your voice is moving. And you've got all kinds of different speeds, pulsating rainbow, pulsating blue, red, everything you can think of. And then also you can set it up on a timer. So if you had a show or something, you can set it up to, to only go for 30 minutes, only go for 45 minutes and that kind of stuff. The Bluetooth connectivity is absolutely phenomenal. I just want to take a second and show you guys how easy this app is. You guys aren't going to be able to see very much during the day, but red, green, blue, orange, purple blue any color you can think of and then obviously it does the strobe as well and I'm oh I'm so happy with those they're so much brighter at night than during the day the install was fairly simple they're just normal LED bulbs again I did have to cut a little bit in the back but I'm super happy with how they turned out even during the day look at that look during the day you can still I know the red's not very bright green blue orange you can't see much um, purple and then the light blue dude that's so cool I'm so happy with that and I can't wait to get the wheel lights installed too. So then I'll have the wheel lights going at the same time as those. Oh, you're not gonna be able to tell me anything. I'm gonna be riding around getting pulled over all day long, man. This is just a, a slow strobe that, just to be able to show you guys what all the colors look like. I don't have it currently right now. It's not dark where I can show you guys when I'm filming this, but it looks amazing. Red is my favorite, obviously, and I'm super excited to have these lights and be able to show them off at shows and stuff like that. Step one, the demon eyes or color changing headlights are installed in the truck. Step number two, to finally get lighting trends all on the truck and other products down the road is to finish the wheel lights. I don't think you guys understand how excited I am to be able to have some of these mods done. Every now and then we'll go through spurts where we're not doing anything to the truck and then we get back doing stuff to the truck and it's so exciting. Again, you guys know about the partnership and my wheel lights are going on in the next week or two so I'm really excited about that. But uh, I'm really in the planning process of trying to figure out what to do with the truck as far as rebuilding it. 
we, we've got a lift kit and we know I don't even know what color we're gonna do or any wheels or tires so leave some comments below what you guys think I should do to the truck as far as when I rebuild it and everything I'd love to hear what you guys think so you guys are the best again I have let's get this bread shirts DM me on Instagram at that white bow tie to find out pricing and stuff like that and uh, I do have decals and stuff as well and some koozies too which is pretty cool I love you guys I'll see you guys next time I hope you guys enjoyed hit the like and subscribe button and as always let's get this bread